Well, we, I think we have to be really pushed to um, the extreme by uh, the requirements of a client for us to fire them as such. Um, we try to you know, provide the best possible service and reverse the risk in the relationship um, with clients and um, you know, we endeavor like crazy to deliver a really good positive experience for clients. When clients are really disappointed in us, it's usually because of some misunderstanding. Uh, quite often it relates to contingencies that have arisen during the currency of an application which has gone off plan for uh, usually as a result of a client not being able to deliver something for us or a fact emerging that means that uh, what we thought was going to be the situation in fact wasn't the situation and we're trying to deal with the ramifications of that. Very often the client in those circumstances doesn't appreciate that we've uh, sort of bought into a bargain we didn't think we were getting and we're just earnestly trying to sort things out for them. That can make the relationship a little bit stressful and uh, I think if the client steps over the line and doesn't understand that we're trying to fix something that really wasn't of our understanding or our own doing uh, and insists to keep prodding and poking us, that's probably the circumstances that would lead us to fire a client, but I haven't done it yet. Okay.